What's up, fellas? Welcome back. It is Friday, November the 27th, Black Friday. Um, here in Canada, we're celebrating it too. Um, but I know it's really a U.S. holiday and it comes right after Thanksgiving. So everybody that's watching from the U.S., hopefully you guys had a great Thanksgiving. And hopefully you guys got out today and found, out, found some cool stuff because Walmart, I think uh, nationwide, has been putting out um, bins. I know we got some and hopefully you guys got some too. So that's what this is about. This is a haul and a very surprising haul because a lot of new stuff. Uh, looks like Canada is finally catching up or even being on the same level or playing field as the US. So I'll share with you guys what I got right here. I'll start off with yesterday. Um, they had a bin uh, that was supposed to be put out on Black Friday and that store had put it out on Wednesday. So I totally missed it. It got picked through on Thursday. It got picked through on uh, Friday morning. So the only thing that I was able to find from that um, bin, if I can find it here, is the Porsche. This is the Porsche 956A Outlaw, which is just a phenomenal, phenomenal piece. So no treasure hunt that I went through. That was totally gone. This was at the very bottom. Uh, took it though. It was one of the cards I really wanted on a card, so that was really cool. But what I was pleasantly surprised to find is um, a shipper that contained, you know, Disney cars, Thomas the Trains, and Camouflage cars. But in it, they also had road tripping cars. And we've moved on to the next series, which has a Toyota 2000 GT. This thing is just awesome. Uh, Frank's Kids was actually one of the first people I've seen um, finding these and posting it. Um, and I knew I wanted it from the moment I saw it. Um, there was quite a few. I picked up five. Um, these don't get released regularly here in Canada, so I picked up as many as I could. Uh, they're not cheap in Canada, so I didn't get um, as many as there would have been in that bin, but I ended up picking up five, so that was pretty cool. Left some for the next collector uh, to take advantage of. Um, and then today, um, I went to another store because um, they were supposed to put the shipper out yesterday. Uh, I talked to the manager, and um, he actually was... Um, not too helpful. I mean, I knew the bin was in the store, and he said he had looked for it, but he couldn't find it. But he says to come back on Sunday, because the next day they would put it out. And I'm thinking there's no way they're going to put a Black Friday bin out on a Sunday. So I didn't really believe him. I took what he said with a grain of salt and went this morning. Uh, lo and behold, I found it, and luckily it wasn't picked through. Um, I knew it wasn't picked through because there was, um, at the top, there was some Batman cars some cool ones from Mario Kart or Super Mario Brothers, uh, DeLorean, stuff that would normally in my area get picked through and not left be left behind. Um, so this bin is an octagon, very messy to go through because it also has a divider. Half of it was A and uh, B case cars on short cards and the other half was C case on long cards. So I ended up picking up more of the Porsche. So I've got another three. Um, from the A case, I got the Firebird Shorty, which looks awesome. On a short card, the design of the car and even the new design for the 2016 card just looks incredible. So, picked up two of these. Probably my favorite short card is the um, 180 NSX Type X. Looks really, really cool. Um, this actually would have been, what, a Q case, if I'm not mistaken? That was in there too. So it looks like Q, A, B, short cards, and then C case long. There's another Porsche there. I'm really digging these. Really, really digging this. Um, and then I picked up three of these. These are C case cars. There's three of the Nissan uh, Fair Lady Z. Looks totally awesome. They had a ton of these, but you know, I was on a budget, so I couldn't really take that much. Especially since I already purchased some. Um, some road tripping cars the night before. But I'm happy with this. And then of course the main event, you know, I was looking for a super. Uh, that was really my goal for that bin. Um, these bins that I'm telling you about with a high ratio of short cards is really hard to find a super in, but luckily I found one. Um, this one here, I was, uh, it was sent to me by uh, Crazy Toys about a month ago. Absolutely awesome piece. Probably one of my favorite supers of the year. Um, today I was going for the Hornet because I knew that's one I, I needed or even the Tesla. Uh, didn't find that, but luckily they had a C case one. Bottom of the bin, 
has a bend but not a crease luckily so I'm gonna put this under some books and strain that bad boy out and then it'll go right into a protecto my only regret because there weren't that many in the bin I uh, was leaving the regular which actually looks pretty cool so I might see if I can head back this weekend if it's still there I pick up the regular the mainline version but obviously the goal was at this moment to get the super so really excited about that um, and that's all I have for you guys right now it's a very very cool haul lots of new cars for us here in Canada uh, really excited with this one here so hopefully you guys are gonna have a great weekend hopefully you guys had a great Thanksgiving and like I said Black Friday a lot, a lot of stuff is hitting Walmart I know in the US you guys get more stuff than we do so hopefully you guys got out there and found something that you liked so um, the streak also continues I think I've mentioned this in previous videos and I've mentioned it to John Fernandez me and him talk quite a bit every time that I send out a box an REOK or a trade I end up finding a chase in the wild so that is a, a nice streak to have um, I sent out a box to Lamar Fashan uh, you guys check out Lamar he just reached 300 subscribers and plus he just won a contest so he's been on quite a roll and uh, we did a little bit of a trade slash REOK so his box should be there next Tuesday or Wednesday he might put out a video for that um, I know he'll enjoy the box, so hopefully you guys can catch that. So that's all I want have right now, guys. Um, if I find some more stuff, obviously I'll post more videos. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, uh, you guys can check me out there. It's uh, Pete's underscore diecast. Um, I post a lot of my stuff there. You probably see it before I put it on YouTube. But uh, it's a great community there as well, just like here on YouTube. Um, and that's all I have for you guys right now. Take care, guys. Have a great weekend.